A uh, big announcement from Mayor Adams this morning. He says he's ending the so-called 90-day rule in an effort to get more people out of shelters and into their own homes. Natalie Dudrich is live in front of City Hall to explain. Natalie. Well, hi there, Mary. That's right. Until now, people living in shelters had to wait at least 90 days, three months, before they could even begin the process of applying for a housing shelter. But the mayor is now hoping by canceling this 90-day rule that they will be able to move out of shelters into permanent housing. Now, he signed this legislation this morning. It takes effect beginning today, and it comes weeks after the city council passed a larger package of four bills that included expanding the voucher program to not just just those in shelters, but New Yorkers struggling to pay rent. Now, the mayor agreed with the canceling of the 90 day rule, but he does not agree with that larger package of bills, saying it would cost taxpayers too much and says there's already so much competition for the small amount of affordable housing units in the city. Our goal is to get people into permanent housing. That's our, that's our goal. We can't accomplish that goal if the inventory is not there. People often look at the city and say build more without realizing the beginning process of building more starts upstate. Eliminating the 90-day rule, what that does is just allow for you to be able to begin the process towards getting your voucher when you faster, much faster. Now, the cancellation of the 90-day rule also comes as the city continues to struggle to find housing for the influx of asylum seekers. And homeless advocates say today is a small win, but they are still urging the mayor to sign that entire package of bills. In Lower Manhattan, Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News. Natalie, thank you.